Hello, my name is Hamid. Today I'm working on this drawer. As you can see, uh, my customer uh, called me for the maintenance of this drawer, and she was also complaining about um, getting rusty stuff on the clothes, or uh, clothes were looking kind of burnt spots on them. So. <clears throat> I opened it apart, vacuumed everything, everything is working uh, fine now, looks good. I replaced the bearing, it's here, now the bearing looks like this. And the part number 5303281153, that's the rear bearing that goes to the back of the drum. It looks from inside like this. And I also replaced the the belt. I'm gonna replace it. I have the belt part number. It's one three four five zero three six zero zero. Uh, the reason I'm replacing this belt is that you can see cracks on the belt. see cracks on all over the places of belt so if it's, if you're doing a maintenance on the drawer and you see belt has cracks like this you need to replace it otherwise you don't want to go for another service called a recall uh, or call back I mean um, also on the front panel it's the front panel This is the door. The drum sits over here. I saw that I saw that this white felt piece was off. It was off to the ground. Um, the top piece is the top felt piece is different. The bottom one is different. This is gray color. This one is white color. Um, I also have both of these but I I'm not recommending my customer to f replace it because this dryer is already 17 years old and the new parts are not really good the way they used to make these fills they are the best but even if I replace it with the new one it's still not uh, better than these ones so I had to use this um, high temperature AC uh, to install this piece back in. It looks okay, it looks fine. I can see a little bit of wear in here. As you can see it's worn out. How this area looks and the far you go, it goes deeper. I'm not gonna replace this piece because it's a still it's still in good shape, um, I will ask my customer to keep eye on it. Uh, if they have problem, I will replace this piece. But I do not recommend them to replace this. The motor is in a good shape. It's a little bit dusty. I tried my best to do some cleanup, but it's okay. The bearing is also, well, I mean the idler pulley is also in good shape. I had to put some lubing on it. And it spins fine. There's no problem with this. It's just black color from the belt. Um, so the main problem on this drawer that leaves leaves uh, black or rusty spots on the drawer. You're gonna put the drum on its back just like this. Uh, open three screws. One from there, one from there, and one from there. And I already got the three screws out, that's a uh, Robertson. So you take this off. Okay. Look at this stuff. How thick is this? These debris and garbage 
or build up at the back of this little piece. Uh, let me clean it. Here, these are all the garbage stuff for rusty stuff that stays on the clothes. See how it looks? And this bracket stays at the back of the drum and it looks like this. So if you don't open the drum apart, you would never get to these and you would never be able to fix this problem. So this is the main problem for rusty stuff on the clothes or burning spots on the clothes. The dryer is not burning your clothes, but these stuff comes off and you feel that something is burning. A uh, customer was also I'm complaining about the smell. Of course, your drawer is gonna smell if you have that much dust in, so the drawer drum. Also from the back, over here, as you can see, it looks burner spot. My customer asked me if it's, if it's safe and normal um, because we get lots of garbage and debris there at the back every time it, you run the drawer. I would say that's normal and there's nothing wrong. Um, on your drawers, always uh, try your best to use a solid ventilation hose. I can see a little bit of uh, flexible hose, that's not too bad. These hoses are fire hazard, but because it's in a stock after the solid hose, I would still um, accept it as okay. Uh, there's no problem. But if you use white, white hose, they're fire hazard, they're not safe. And it can cost you more money on the electricity because the dry, dryer runs for a long time uh, there's not enough or good air circulation but with the solid pipe uh, because the moisture gets out of the dryer easily without any problem uh, you can save some money on the dryer because on the electricity because uh, the dryer finishes the cycle quickly and the moisture gets out easily other than that it's really simple drawer that has only a start button and a selection uh, a timer. They get less problems. So again, my main video was on uh, the complaint of the customer that she was getting uh, burning spots or rusty spots on the drawer and I did some maintenance.